Hey guys, it's beautiful, it's sunny, and welcome to our E3 vlog. First time we're doing like a joint vlog yes. together at E3. Yes, that's right. Cool. I'm really excited. We're just going to be filming everything and anything that we get up to during this event. All the EA stuff, tournament stuff I'm doing, sim stuff you're doing. Right now, anything also and everything. includes my scalp burning in the sun, so that's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> well, it is very hot. Today is, as you said, EA Play Day. We're going to go doing a live stream. We're going to be checking out the Penthouse Lounge, Ooh. and I'm going to be getting some sim suits and stuff. So it's going to be nice. a super, super fun. And hopefully we're going to show you guys some cheeky stuff. Yeah, so I've also got a Fortnite tournament going on. I'm going to be on an official E3 live stream. And then we're obviously going to be going to E3, the event itself. So for any of you guys that don't have a chance to come to these kind of places, or just want to see us both uh, at these kind of gaming events and doing our thing, then this is going to be all of that in one place. And if you're excited for this, make sure you give it a big fat thumbs up. We're going to start our E3 adventure right here, right now. So let's do it. at EA Play. This is the VIP kind of capture area. There's a load of cool stuff going on. Let's go and check it out. So this is, it's Claire said, the VIP area. Most people can't come in here unless you're here to play all the games early. You've got a special invite. We're going to show you guys outside as well where there's going to be loads of other games. But in here, we've got Battlefield 5 that you can play early. All of these guys are playing, recording on their PC setup. In fact, I think everywhere here is just a load of Battlefield 5. But there's loads of other EA games, obviously. This space is just a nice hangout place. So we come here, relax, get some drinks, get some food. And I think we should go outside and see what other games they have to offer. Because I know they have Sims for seasons outside. And I want to go and see it. I've actually got a capture section for it later today where I hope to be able to show you guys a little bit more. I'm going to capture some of it for my channel as well. And it's looking really good. It's looking really good. So we are chilling out here on a little cool like penthouse rooftop. It is very nice. It's nice at EA Play. They've given us guacamole and anything to do with avocado is always going to make me happy. So. This free food, amazing views, and playing games that technically only just come out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we've actually got something really cool that we're going to stream. Yes. And as Ali said, it's only literally just come out. It is Unravel 2. It's going to put my channel, we're playing it as like a co-op game The together. last game wasn't co-op, was it? it was no, the so last long. one was just single player, and yeah. it's, it's such a cute game. Like, the beauty of this game is just absolutely gorgeous. So as soon as they were like, oh, do you want to yeah. be one of the first to play it and first to stream it? And it's co-op, and you get to play with Ali. I'm like, oh, yes, this, 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 this sounds great. I'm honestly I'm really excited. I never played it. I saw her play on her channel. So I think we'll show you guys some cool clips from the stream yeah, of us playing because I think you'll really, really like it. How are you feeling? You nervous? I'm, I'm, I always get nervous for a stream. Like if you guys saw me on my first ever stream, I was just like this bumbling, scared mess. I always get super, super nervous to stream. But you guys are always so nice in the comments. So it's and it's not my fun. stream, so I'm super chilled, ready to go. I'm more nervous <laughs> I'm about this Fortnite tournament. Nervous. So we've both You're got our own things going on. We're, we're gonna, everything's Great. But also, it's worth saying that um, Unravel 2 is actually on Origin Premium. So oh, if nice. you have Origin Premium, you literally get Unravel like with it for free. Oh, which is really cool. There you go. So we're gonna show you guys some of our Unravel 2 stream, and hopefully, you guys are gonna like it. And I think we should show you the view over our oh, shoulder. Oh, you need to see the view. It's pretty special. So we've got an amazing view of downtown LA over there. If I, my bearings are right, I think the beach in Santa Monica are over in that direction, I think. Oh. And then I think the Hollywood sign is either somewhere along here, basically. It's right there, you can't see it. I don't think you can quite see it, but to give you an idea of where the actual convention is, I don't know if Claire can zoom in on it, but that building has Oh my gosh, big, pressure. <laughs> This is a big blue building with like a crane on top of it on the right hand side. That one just there. Oh, well yeah. done. I'm just like literally panicking so hard. <laughs> well done. You look at you, you little geography teacher. Our, uh, our hotel's right next there. So we, we're, we're traveling all over to go to all of these different gaming events and press conferences and everything. So it's cool. You get to see a lot of the town. We've got to get ready for Claire's stream. We've got to go and actually play this game. I'm excited to give it a go for the very first time. It should be a load of fun. Person that stays. Okay, on, okay. And you be the person that does interesting okay, things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Cool down. Oh my 
my gosh, across. so many of you guys. Okay, quickly do the jump. Okay. No, you gotta go on the other. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. How did you guys put up watching a whole. Oh, series? you guys didn't see how much I edited <laughs> out when I did it? Do you okay, so, so time? you go first, because it starts moving. So just fall down off there onto there. Okay. Just push your character off. And then do a whole day, big jump. Yeah, you're fine, you're fine, okay. you're fine. Wait, don't go too far. I've got to, make, I've got to do the same thing. Hold on. Okay, there you Quickly! Go. Okay, we did it, we did it, we did it. Ooh. Ooh! You can jump off walls. Oh my gosh, parkour! You only parkour. This is all my Mario skills coming back in. Look at so Oh my gosh! It's beautiful! Bam! So this is the moment I have been waiting for, like literally since I landed, because I'm going to get the chance to play Sims 4 Seasons. You guys, I am literally so, so hyped. I've just finished my EA stream. We were doing Unravel 2, and we weren't great at it. To like put it lightly, we weren't amazing. But this is it's fine, because we're going to play Sims 4 Seasons, and I can play The Sims. I know how to make babies and make people get married in a game, so I'm good. I've got this under control. But just before I start playing it, I wanted to show you guys something, a beautiful union that has been waiting to happen for a long time because I've met loads of simmers while we've been here but there's, there's one simmer that I've been particularly wanted to meet and also I have a bonus additional simmer so this is just gonna be beautiful beautiful little bit of video for you guys because look at the side of me right now we actually have Hi. oh my gosh it's where did you come from? What's next for you guys here? <laughs> so we have Sally Gracie. I almost said Sally Gracie again. I'm sorry. Hey, okay, everyone does it. Everyone so, does it. I have Sally Gracie with me, and also I don't know if you can see it just behind. Sim Supply James as oh, well. Oh, it's a beautiful oh, symphony. It's a Simmers. A Sim Symphony. So I've been like super hyped to meet you guys. You guys have been here for a while already, though, right? Yeah, I've been here for four nights. Four nights. I still feel jet lagged to her. Like, I'm busy. Busy every day. Busy, yeah. tired. I've been excited to close you up. <laughs> have you been to the beach yet? No. Oh, oh my gosh. Maybe we need to do because we're, we're going to go grab lunch tomorrow, like a beautiful Sydney lunch. Yeah. Maybe we should try and do a little bit of an exploration at the same time. You never know. May get time, may not. But I wanted to show you guys these beautiful faces before I start recording the sims because it's super exciting and you can't see you can't see what's going on behind me now it's all beautiful and overexposed but i am going to be capturing some sim stuff we all are so look for that on our channels and let's play some sims so i want to put ali in a big beautiful yellow raincoat because it looks so adorable all that all that i love this winter look so much i just want to like snuggle into that coat with him because it looks super cozy and then here is my pretty amazing summer look. I'm all about that life. I actually love that look so, so much. So for everyone that watches all of Claire's Sims videos, they're amazing. She's great at telling stories. She's great at building things in The Sims. She's very good at The Sims. I have, I have no experience with the game. I don't really understand it. And when all of Claire's fans know all of the characters and everything that's going on, and I don't even know, apparently I, I found out today that I am a great granddad. I'm, technically I'm dead in, in Claire's Sims series. Um, but I always feel really ignorant, but I know Claire's having a lot of fun capturing a lot of early gameplay, which is awesome. I always get chances to play COD early, DLC early, so it's something I do quite a lot. But it's awesome that Claire gets a chance to do this as well and get some early stuff for her channel, so she's having a lot of fun, and that makes me happy. Go to the show floor, you're gonna be all fortnighting out? Um, I definitely wanna spend some time on the show floor. I always try and sneak my way into the Nintendo booth. I, I mentioned it earlier, Smash, yeah. and I'm like, let me play all of these games early, so yeah. hopefully I have time for that. Al, you're sticking around, because I think you're gonna you're gonna play with Ninja for the first time? Yeah, yeah, that is the plan of action. Um, I'm gonna be using a controller, Okay, that's like, all I know. You good? Nope. Yep. <laughs> oh man. Alright, that was it. We're good now. Oh nice. Come on, give me a chug jug. Oh. Bandages. Two mid, two mid. Oh, oh, dude, I'm coming. Try to stay alive. Oh, seven. Where's he? He's on me. Nice. Oh. Woo! I think it was too hot. I agree with him. Why, why 200? Don't care. 
to gaming controller. This has been developed in partnership with Sony and you've got these brand new sax buttons on the side here, S1 and S2 buttons. And then obviously all four of the back paddles as well. So in a total of six additional buttons, what you normally get on a standard controller is absolutely insane. This is the first time I've actually held it and it feels good. It feels really good. I'm hoping I can maybe take one home today, use it myself when I get back. This is amazing. It feels so nice. In games like Fortnite as well, you need as many buttons as possible. Something like this is just crazy. Do you think you'd be able to use as many buttons as these? Oh my gosh, no, I'd just be pressed them all by accident. <laughs> this would be a complete rip in the shop for me. You can also, it's got a touch screen on the front here, I believe, for the mic and for the volume. So, so much additional content on a controller you just never would normally get. It's crazy, like, look at that. I don't know how you like press those. Maybe like push them in with your hands like that. That's crazy. That's gonna make me an even bigger, better, Fortnite player on console. I'm, I'm hyped. This pier was like the place to go and catch Pokemon. We have so many like cool memories of coming here. You got mobbed, right? Yeah, well this went in the heyday, this is the place to go. To a point where so many people would come and play here that your phone signal would die yeah. because so many people were on their phones in one place. But if we whipped our a camera out like this two years ago, you'd just get surrounded by people yeah. because we were the main people making Pokemon Go videos at the time. It was a lot of fun. It was cool. And speaking of people making Pokemon Go videos, I filmed a video here in LA probably about a year and a half ago and Mystic actually walked past in the background, yeah. pulled a face, those of you guys spotted it. it's the first time we probably met him and chatted with him, we've met him a few times since then. And I caught my first Chansey here, like on a night time when all the lights were on. It's just, it's just like a bit of a special Pokemon Go place for us, isn't I'd it? I'd say it's, it's the number one Pokemon Go place in the world yeah. when you think about Pokemon Go. Oh my gosh, Blastoise on that beach down oh, there. Yeah. And then do you remember I threw like 56 Ultra Balls, every single Ultra Ball I had, and didn't get it. And you probably had about 200 people around you in yeah. a big park filming you. I was trying to film you for your vlog. It was pretty crazy. So guys, this is what Santa Monica Pier looks like. You, I'm sure you've seen it in loads of Pokemon Go videos, to be honest with you. It's amazing. There's a Koga raid at the end. There's a Tyranitar raid next to it. It is so good. And obviously, if you look at the nearby list, it's filled with water Pokemon. Yeah. But the special thing we want to show you guys, and I'm sure loads of you have done it, we are very late to this because we have been saving it yeah. for a Pokemon video. <laughs> it's actually the mythical discoveries, which you have to go through quite a lot to get. Yeah, it so took us a long time. Like, there was a few things that took us ages. Finding a ditto took ages. Although it didn't take as long as it took no, my mum. It took your mum longer. And she's like, Two million XP ahead of me. She plays even more than we do. Um, but we eventually got those dishes. Yeah, because one of them was also um, evolved a Gyarados, and I'd evolved a Gyarados right before the mythical oh, yeah, that was thing bad time. began. So I was like, now it's a catch. Like, those are those magic cups, but we got there and we are ready to do our mythical discovery. Yes, yeah, so we're going to do them at the same time. Yes. And we're going to see who gets the better CP Mew. Yeah. And maybe one of us can get 100% IV Mew, which oh is gosh, the goal whenever you do this. No. Oh my gosh, hopefully this camera is still working. God. Someone just kicked the ball and it hit our camera square on. I actually got a scratch on my lens now, but hopefully you can still see us okay. And we've, you've not missed things, guys. I'm not okay, on the starting okay. counter yet. Okay, I'm gonna click it, I'm gonna click what it. What are they on I was mad. He couldn't, Football to be fair, nowhere. accurate shot, but not what you want to hear. I mean, also, like, look around us. Like, we're in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> I don't even know how the ball got to us because we picked a quiet spot on purpose, but hey, at least at least the camera looks like it's working. Okay, you ready for this? Okay, alright, I clicked mine. Okay, I'm clicking mine. Mine's a bright so white screen. Shot. Three, two, one. Oh, there's me! Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Mine's in front of my feet! <gasps> no, no, no! It's kind of visible. It oh is my like gosh. Goes, like, you, can't, you can't see what I use it is either. <gasps> and you can't use berries or anything. Yo, wait, what? You can't use berries. 
Wait, so do, do you get them all at the same same CP? I don't even know. I don't even know. How do I even hit I it? I can't even see. Can you only hit it when it's uh Wait, what? <gasps> no, you can't hit it when it's invisible. Oh my gosh. If I get this one in the first ball as well, it's worth it. So you two. can't pin up it. <gasps> no, I can't. Oh, it's not even worth it. Okay, I'm going to hit it with this one. Oh, that's horrible. 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 Oh, I worked out that you can actually get him in Pokemon Road as well, like in the OG Pokemon game. That's there crazy. is a way to get him. I never knew at the time. I always thought you had to go to the SS Un and like wait to the end of the game before you did the SS Un, then go to the truck. And if you moved the truck yeah. using the push thing, he would be under the truck. And it wasn't, but there is a way to get him. And I did it later on on Pokemon How? Yellow when I was like in my 20s. How do you do that? You have to like you you. You basically do the game in a different order, and when you go back and speak to a certain person that gives, gives you the tutorial on how to catch the Pokemon, it will reset like some of the coding in the game to do with the numbers, so that the next Pokemon you encounter so it shouldn't be me, but will it, be you. Can do it. Yeah, That's and it, it's crazy. legit. It's a legit way to do it. You don't need to cheat to get him. You don't need to use any sort of dodgy software, and it will be a real life Love Mew. That. So I have Mew on the game as well. I've just checked my CP by the way. So okay, okay. Me. Register mine the Pokédex. He's such a baby. Okay, okay. Okay, what's your first number? One. Second number? Three. Oh my god, mine's a lot worse than yours, and <gasps> mine's two. M one, eight. Eight, nine. Oh, oh no! Ah! Okay, it's Mine's a wonder one. still, so yours could be 100%. Oh my, no, don't. What, no, is, don't, it? what don't, is it? What is it? What is it? A wonder. wonder HP. HP defense. <gasps> oh. oh my gosh, so close. That's Professor Birch is just saying, this is experience to remember forever. Wow. My assistant and I will request some special research from you in the future. Stay tuned. Oh, Wait, have... what? Look, just bought that. Wait, that's, oh. I'm about to get like 20,000 no, XP. That's so cool. Bam, 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 bam. bam. Oh, 20 new reward. candies. <gasps> so that's how you get the candies for him, you guys. Hey, I did okay, it. Okay, that's good to know. <gasps> What is it? What is it? Ninety-eight percent. You! Oh That's my so gosh! Good. I'm super happy about that. He's not giving much away, but I guarantee you, his feet are on fire. Because I just run like a gecko the whole way over. So you won't, we won't be able to see this on camera, but the two idiots, the Irish and the English, we've been out in the sun for 20 minutes and we are burning like crazy. Like my thighs are super, super burn. I don't know why we thought we could sit in the sun for any more than two minutes, but why we tried. We do why do we do this? Now we have to go and run away and hide in the shade like the ghouls that we clearly are. So guys, today is actually the day of Ali's Fortnite Pro-Am. I'm so sorry we didn't vlog a little bit more yesterday. It was kind of like my first day proper chatting with Deli and those guys and I don't know, I just kind of felt weird about just whipping out a camera. I just wanted to chit chat to them and get to them a little bit more. And also we were at the Ivy, which is a restaurant that apparently you sometimes get a celeb spot. Apparently Leonardo DiCaprio has been there, which is super cool. However, my pasta, actually better at the pub next to our house just saying we're gonna go to whole foods which i've never been in before before going to la which is actually amazing i love it so so much got this little avocado sushi that's what we're getting for breakfast and then we're gonna head over to fortnite so i'm playing in this tournament with three million dollars on the line all for charity my charity as i mentioned in my video is for wwf which stands for the world wildlife Find foundation i believe it's the full name yeah I think um so. and they basically do a load of environmental work to uh, make sure that things are more sustainable uh, less waste more recycling and obviously a load of animal conservation as well specifically for animals that are endangered animals yeah, we've and yeah three now yeah I do, you know, do you know we're swimming 
got. Snow leopard? Yep. Is one a lion? No. Tiger? You should get a lion though. Yeah, tiger. And then what's the third one? I don't know. A uh, regular leopard. Oh, I black leopard. I want to get a clouded leopard too. Just like regular like, leopard that you get in Africa. Ah, like, not so I thought it may be another leopard. <laughs> but that's a charity I'm going to be supporting. Obviously, it's a charity that Claire already supports. So any money that I get in this tournament will go straight to them, which is amazing. Now, all of these players are extremely good. I play on console instantly at a disadvantage against all of these guys that play and stream every single day for like 10 hours a day on, on PC. But it's all about the fun, the experience, and I'll take you guys along with us to show you the day because it's a crazy, crazy setup. And hopefully we can do as well as possible. If I come top 25, I'll be happy. So we've got sushi, we've got pizza, we've got sandwiches, we've got our dirty chai lattes. <laughs> now we're gonna head over to the stadium so you can win, right? So I can win in my dreams. You never know, it could happen. I believe me, Baba. They've made the ice cream truck that you could find dotted around in the map in Fortnite in real life, even with the ice cream cone coming out the top of it. <laughs> and they've also made the actual battle bus that you fly into the map on in real life. So we're here a little bit early, so we're gonna just like sneak around and have a look before it gets filled with everyone else. This is so cool. The real life battle bus we snuck in to get really, really close. These guys are hyped. They said they've been waiting all day to watch the tournament. I think they're literally gonna fill the football stadium with people watching, supporting. It's gonna be a crazy atmosphere. My baby is top 10. So it's just finished. Ali literally came fit. So he's won £80,000 for WWF. I'm about to go and see him. They just signed some signatures on stage. I was literally shaking the whole match. I'm so, so proud of my baby. He's amazing. He was like the only one in that top position with a controller. And he was by himself for like the whole match as well. He's been so good. We had a lot of luck. Yeah. We landed with no one else. We got to loot up the whole of the place we landed in. And then we ninja passed so many people. And then took out, I took out Willy Rex. It was bad. We both know Willy Rex. He came sick, I came fifth. It was good. It was good. It was a really, really, really fun tournament. And you enjoy watching? Yeah, I was screaming from the crowd. And like everybody I was with was like, I can't believe he's top 50 with a controller. I can't believe he's top 40, top 30, top 20, top 10. But I can't believe he did that with a controller. It was it was it was crazy. It was crazy. And I think maybe I could have lasted a little bit longer, but I was by myself. I, yeah, I took on a duo as team. Yeah, I took yeah. on Willy Rex's teammate. And at that point, like the ring was off me, I had to move up, they were all above, there yeah. wasn't much I could do. They'd all built so high and also like like Ninja and his teammate had lived near to the end for like the match before as well. Like they knew how to play together. And they'd practiced before, yeah. so like you you no one's respect against you. It's just amazing that you got 80k for the video. Yeah. That's it's what you're it's, it's about. crazy. I'm so proud. I'm a bit like Dream, but I'm pumped. That was a crazy after party. Oh, yeah. Like llamas in the sky. Like, There's flamethrowers. look amazing. It's yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. So, guys, as you can probably tell, we are back in the UK now. Oh, wow. <laughs> We're back with no. the bean who's apparently choking on something. Oh, no. And Darcy, look. There he is. Oh yeah, and Darcy as well. And you can probably tell there's a little bit of a new environment that we are in as well. Yeah, we have finally got the kitchen finished and we absolutely love it. So it's a little bit of a sneak peek for all of you guys that are watching through the end of the video. This is where all the food will be done, obviously, <laughs> oh, from now on. But it's so much better than it was before. If you guys have seen the house tour video, it's awesome. Yeah, it was just like a big, really black dog. There was, there was like walls and stuff. We had them all taken down. And the kitchen got built while we were in LA, which is pretty cool. It might sound a little bit echoey because, you know, it's a kitchen. Also, if you look this way, 
There is absolutely nothing. So that's not going to help with I'm the sure that bit yet. <laughs> We're still like trying to figure that bit out. I think we should make that, that room in Sims and try loads of different options and figure out what we want to do now. We can make a video called and send my house with the Sims. Okay. Like that. I think Claire's getting sidetracked for the kitchen here. She has lots of ideas and the house is almost, almost completely there. But we really hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog. It was a super busy trip. Yes. We actually blended together what was meant to be a separate Pokemon video and a separate vlog just into one massive video because it was so manic yeah. but uh, we always are quite busy during these events and we just wanted to take you guys with us and show you as much as possible like we're usually there for a whole week and everyone we know was there for a week and we were there for like four days so like we literally got in did some stuff and then left straight away so we didn't get to show you guys as much as normal but at least you got to see some stuff with us from la from e3 from ea play from the fortnite pro e e pro -am. No pro AM. I thought it was called pro AM because you played in the morning, even though it was the afternoon. <laughs> I mean, it's a fair assumption to make, but I don't know. Claire's not very enough competitive it, it games, apparently. pro and amateur. Yes, and I was actually the pro, technically. Yeah, so, hey. Uh, but if you guys really enjoyed, obviously give it a big fat thumbs up. If you guys have any other video ideas you'd like for this channel, leave it down below. We apologise, we've missed quite a few weeks of uploads. It's just been manic and crazy, but we haven't forgotten about you guys, and we've got loads more videos planned, don't worry. So thank you guys for watching. We'll see you in another video. Bye. Bye.